So I'm starting a new little series uh, for my channel. I uh, call it a uh, quick fill up. Let's see how long that name lasts. I love my puns, but that one's bad even for me. All right, quick fill up. Okay. So uh, different topics for different fill ups, but usually try to be short and sweet. Now this time I want to talk about uh, categoricals, the universal affirmative, right? and uh, its converse. All right. So the universal affirmative has the form of like all uh, S are P. So S is the subject, P is the predicate. So all dogs are mammals. That's the universal affirmative categorical. I have videos on the other categoricals. I'll let you look at those if you'd like, but I'm not gonna repeat that now. So all, S all SRP, all right. It's converse, a converse of a categorical is when you just switch the place of the subject of the predicate, right? Uh, so the converse is all PRS, right? Uh, all SRP and all PRS. Now, uh, the converse, of a universal affirmative is not equivalent to uh, the universal affirmative. All dogs are mammals. Uh, it's not equivalent, it's converse is not equivalent. All mammals are dogs. If for no other reason that they're an equivalent, <laughs> uh, the first is true, all dogs are mammals, but the second, all mammals are dogs, the converse is false. So we don't get to infer the converse of a universal affirmative from the universal affirmative. We don't get to infer, infer the converse of uni universal affirmative from the universal affirmative. Uh, not only are they not equivalent, it's an invalid inference. It's an invalid inference. So uh, you might say, okay, well, this is kind of obviously true. Why are you bothering it? Bother me with this? Well, we make mistakes like this a lot, right? We, we very quickly uh, do this sort of inference and it's kind of at the root of a lot of, you know, stereotypes. So here, here's the universal affirmative. Now it's not true, but we, <laughs> we often think it's true, right? Or at least the stereotype is true. All, right. all cheaters are men, right? All cheaters in romantic relationships are, are men. It's actually not true. It's not just men, but hey, let's, you know, let's just grant that for, for the second. That's at least the perception that all cheaters are men. Okay, fine. Let, let's just say that's true, right? But we don't get to infer it's converse. All men are cheaters. Right, that's a bad inference. Because the converse of a universal affirmative is not equivalent, nor is in inferred by the universal affirmative. It's an invalid inference, right? Um, what? Uh, is, uh, by the way, this also works for most, right? Say, uh, yeah, so here's, may maybe this is true, right? First one isn't true, maybe this one is true. Most cheaters are men. That, that might be true. I don't know, I haven't done the survey. That's something you have to go out and search for, right? Uh, so let's just grant that that's true. Most cheaters are men. The converse is not valid, right? Most men are cheaters, right? The in inferring the converse is not valid. Most men are cheaters. I mean, maybe it's true that most cheaters are men. Okay, let, let's just take it for granted. But you don't get to infer the converse. Most men are cheaters. Um, you know, here, you know, I mean, for another example of something like that, here, here's something. Um, this is increasingly less the case, but it, you know, <laughs> um, and that, you know, it's a good thing, right? But, you know, there was a time when it was just so obviously true that, that most philosophers are men. Okay. Now, it's a good thing, right? But the, uh, the ratio of men to women in philosophy is becoming more and more even, and that's a good thing. Um, but anyway, you know, in most philosophers are men, what well, you don't get to infer it's converse, most men are philosophers, right? That's really false. Uh, most, uh, I think this is true, don't, don't, please don't bite my head off if it's false, but I think this is true. Most soldiers are men, okay. But, but that doesn't mean you get to infer most men are soldiers. So, you know, when you have these kinds of categoricals, you don't get to infer the converse from the categorical for the universal affirmative. It works for the universal negative and the uh, 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 particular affirmative, but like I said, you have to watch those videos. Right? But the reason why I bring it up is we often make, at least you see it a lot, I see it a lot. This is a common logical fallacy floating around on there that you that you know people will infer right, that something like most cheaters are men, say, well, therefore most men are cheaters. I mean, 
Maybe, you, maybe most men are cheaters, but you're gonna have to go out and, and actually investigate that and, and verify that empirically. You don't get to uh, uh, infer that from the logical form. Okay, so quick, the first quick fill up. You have the universal affirmative. You don't get to infer its contents. Don't get to infer its contents. All right, that was my quick fill up. So what do you think? What do you think? Uh, what are some, maybe some invalid inferences that, that you've heard, right, or that you know of? Right? Uh, you know, I was kind of picking on men a little bit there, but, you know, there's there's some about women, too. Uh, we could start drifting over to other unsavory topics, right? What is your favorite, or <laughs> unfavorite, <laughs> least favorite, uh, invalid inference where we, uh, you know, we infer kind of a prejudice, kind of a stereotype based upon... You know, maybe a true, or at least the perception of a true categorical like that. So, you know, I don't even know if it's true that all or most cheaters are men. Maybe it is, but, you know, usually we infer from that that for most men are cheaters. Uh, we can talk about liars, gossips, uh, all kinds of unsavory sort of categories. So put your answer down in the comments below. Uh, let's take a look. Let's open up this conversation, see what we got. And, uh, you know, maybe we'll work on something else. Okay? See you next time.